Yo, 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 guys, what is up? It's Flip here, and today I'm bringing you a brand new video, and I know you can't see my face, you guys are seeing the controller right now, and that's because I'm going to give you a quick tutorial on how to play Claw, and that's the grip I'm doing on the controller naturally right here. Now, Claw is something that you can do that will give you a lot of edge when you're playing a first-person shooter game, because it allows you to do what's called a jump shot without moving your finger from the aiming stick, to the X or A button depending on what console you're playing. In this right here, if you do this, boom, you won't be able to aim where you're like look where you want to shoot while you're jumping. Unless you do some weird shit like like this and it, it really doesn't work out. So it actually takes away that split second that you have to and you, it's just it's just a bad maneuver to have to take your finger off of the aiming stick because that split second can kill you. Another alternative is a scuff controller, but not everybody has $150 just to drop on a new controller for every system that they have. So the best way, the best alternative for that is to play claw. And that's what this grip looks like right here, as you guys can see. Um, basically, instead of having the normal two pointer fingers on the triggers, I'm gonna put this pointer finger up uh, and rest it up here on top of like the triangle square area on the controller and I'm gonna use my middle finger to click the trigger and this is a little bit uncomfortable when you first start it out it, it it takes it took me about a whole day to get used to just playing like this but my fingers never hurt people complain about their fingers hurting and stuff like that and for me that never really happened it just became the way I hold the controller so now this is just how I hold the controller no matter what game I'm playing so this right here will allow you to click any of the four buttons while you're still using the aim stick so if I'm playing Black Ops 3 and I need to click X multiple times I can still click X while aiming and this gives me that like split like one second half a second re reaction time over somebody that's doing this I get to do them both at the same time, and it's very helpful. This is also very helpful for trick shotting, so you can spin while you're doing these, and it just helps so much whenever you're playing anything that needs a faster reaction time, because this is one of the fastest and easiest ways to click all the buttons besides having a scuff. So this can help you drop shotting, jump shotting, it can help you insta swapping if you're playing Call of Duty, uh, trick shotting. It, there's just so many different ways that playing claw can help you. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if there's anything else I can teach you guys down in the comment section down below. And until next time, it's flipping them out. Thanks, yo.